How does an egg become a chick? The first step in embryonic development is fertilization. You must have a rooster to fertilize your flock's eggs. With no rooster present, eggs will never develop into a chick. 12 to 24 hours after mating, hens will begin to lay fertilized eggs. On days one and two of incubation, there's very little visible development. At this point, the germinal disc has become a blastoderm and cell division is occurring. If you candle your eggs at this point, you won't see signs of life. But if you crack an egg open, the rings around the blastoderm will be clear and visible. By day three of incubation, the circulatory system will be developing and the heartbeat is present. If you candle your eggs this early, you still won't see any signs of life or development. It's best to wait until around day 10 to candle. Between days 4 and 10, a lot happens. The amniotic cavity develops and surrounds the embryo. The eye becomes pigmented, elbows and knees appear, voluntary movement begins, beak develops, comb growth begins, feather tracks can be seen, and on day 9, the embryo begins to look like a bird. On day 10, the egg tooth is prominent and the toenails are visible. When you candle your egg, you'll see a very clear embryo, and when you look closely, you'll see him move around inside the egg. On days 11 through 17, the tail feathers appear, toes are fully formed, scales appear, and down covers the body. The embryo repositions with its head towards the large end of the egg. Its gut is drawn into its abdomen, feathers completely cover the body, and the albumen is almost gone. By day 17, the amniotic fluid has decreased, and the embryo's head's moved between its legs. On day 18, the embryo is almost fully grown. The yolk sac remains outside of the embryo, and its head is tucked under its right wing, preparing for hatch. On day 19, the yolk sac draws into the body cavity, the amniotic fluid is almost gone, and the embryo occupies most of the space within the egg. On day 20, the yolk sac is fully absorbed by the embryo. At this point, the embryo becomes a chick and is pipped into the air cell and is breathing air with its lungs. On day 20, external pipping occurs, and you'll see a tiny crack where the chick will begin to unzip. You may even hear peeping. On day 21, the chick will use its wings as a guide and its legs to turn around and pierce the shell in a circular motion called unzipping. It'll then use its legs to push its way out of the shell. In 12 to 24 hours, the chick will fully emerge.